Okay, welcome to a quick video of a whole bunch of items uh, that need to go. We're cleaning out a uh, home that's been lived in since about 1945, I believe. Uh, not sure where this house came from. I do know it's an antique. Uh, the red is in pretty good condition, uh, although there is a piece that's on the back that's coming off right here. That could probably just be stitched right back up, and it's missing one wheel on the bottom. Uh, these chairs here, they were pulled out of a ice cream shop back in 1967. Uh, there's uh, these five here, plus there's some more outside that I have. Uh, just some pictures that we have. Uh, can't really read the name. I don't know. Uh, these may have been done by family. This one was, I know, done by family. And uh, let's go for a quick walk. Um, we have that mirror right there that is available. We have uh, quite a few vase, vase, little Santa Claus things. Uh, that big picture is not available. Um, this is just the big punch bowl with a bunch of these glasses in it. And then there's some more punch stuff back there. And some kitchenware. I'm open to all options on these. All options. Some of the more unique things, like a little swan, a little Santa Claus thing, whatever the heck that is. Everybody needs a chicken. And the microwave. and possibly some of these things here. These are supposedly more to keepsakes, but not too sure. Uh, let's see if we can get a, a view of the cedar chest. That's very nice. It's full of uh, more antique stuff. A um, couple things that I do know that we have in here. Uh, some stuff from schools. There's something about landing on the moon in here somewhere. There. And walks on the moon. July 21st, 1969. Small step for man. A leap for mankind. Wonder if somebody's interested in that. And I don't know what else is in here to be honest. There's probably more personal keepsake items instead of other items. Family pictures and photos. Oh, an American flag. Got to take care of that. I'll be keeping that. All right, let's go outside. Okay. First things first. I don't know if you can see it. This is an Ethan Allen hutch. It's got the two doors on the top. It's got shelf there, shelf there. This opens up. It's got a little shelf, a little spot over here for some stuff. It's got some drawers. There's some better pictures on the uh, Picasso piece. Got this Cario piece, the glasses in the house for the shelving. Uh, it's been chewed on by the dog down there. Not this one, but this one. Got some antique golf clubs. Get a quick look at these. Uh, don't know how old they are. All inclusive. Make an offer. Uh, nails, screws, nails, screws, nails, and more. Uh, this here is a rolled up kids pool security screen. Uh, this goes around the pool to keep the kids away. I also have two gates that are right here. You would need to drill holes in your patio in order to support it. I've got no pro on welders, but I've got this piece here. I do know that when we had a garage sale, when my family member passed, my father was wanting 
400 for this. But uh, first one to make an offer is the one that's respectable and acceptable. We'll get it. And here's another gauge. And more nails and more screws. I've got a kiln. I don't know anything about this thing. Um, I do know that it's finicky. I do know that it's probably even homemade. Maybe it's not. My grandmother used it. She made an ungodly amount of stuff in it. Uh, but it is very old. It's not guaranteed to work. Let's make an offer. I've got an antique dresser. This is what I know a lot of you guys will be looking to get into. Uh, it's definitely old. It's definitely an antique. That mark looks original. I don't know. Um, we, this house has been empty for three years. Uh, everything's just been sitting here. So, uh, I'm not sure exactly what's going on with this, but I do know that it had a little bit of termites. We're getting the, we're getting the, uh, house tenant, so that's going to be treated. Um, got a Sears Craftsman 15 and a half inch drill press. It does work. Works like a champ. Um, not selling the air conditioner. Some other torch thing. Vice. Table saw. It works. I used it yesterday. Got a uh, parts cleaner. Hadn't been used in a couple years. Um, back here in the corner. Let me get some lights on. Back here in the corner. Another one of the highly collectible items. Lionel train set. Got all kinds of goodies in here. Tracks and other stuff. I don't know much about trains, but I know enough to know that they're worth stuff or something. And so we got that piece there. Now, one of these is heavier than the other. This one here is heavier. There's this one, and then there's some more down inside, one, two, three, and then like a track piece. Some tool, if you can identify it and name a price, then you can have it. Here's the tanks for that other torch, the first one that I showed you. I've got a ton of molds, a ton of molds. This whole shelf, all that, there's some more behind that bed. This fan is available. This fan moves an ungodly amount of air. Um, it's been around for who knows how many years. It's got a nice solid base to it. Um, got a bed. Uh, I think it's more of a elderly or handicapped style bed. Uh, it goes up and down. I think it's motorized actually. Yes, it's got the cord on it. It's got some motor on it. Some other stuff. I don't know. Make an offer. Uh, roofing stuff. I don't know what the heck this is. I know it's for roofing. Got a whole box of it. Got a toolbox. Some more tanks. Some more molds. Another mold. Uh, just thinking, just to make sure that I'm not missing anything. The kayak is not for sale. Oh, chair. Old recliner. Comes with the dog marks on the edges. Probably could be cleaned up fairly easy. But, uh, you know, overall, uh, I've got lots of, like I said, nails. Um, some wood. Make a quick offer. Looks like I got some 2x6s, some 2x4s here. Also have some more of there. And there's the rest of the chairs. That's it for now. Send me an email if you want to know anything.